The Nutcracker. Now, let's march. One, two, one, two, one, two. That's right. Attack! Attack! There! Let's see. A lavender coat, a pair of shiny new boots. What a sweet, nice-looking doll he is. Who on earth would you be? <laughs> wow! Look, it's a nutcracker! Stop it, <laughs> Let's see. That's right. Uh, crack it, crack it, crack more walnuts! <sighs> Please stop it, Fritz! If you're too rough with him, you'll break Mr. Nutcracker! <laughs> it won't break. <laughs> I don't wanna. Hey, uh, wait! Give it Stop! Back. Ah. Uh, <gasps> you did it. You got in my way and broke it, Clara. This is not my fault. Poor Mr. Nutcracker. I know. Tomorrow morning, I'll take you right over to Herr Drosselmeyer's shop. He can fix you up for sure. So can you fix Mr. Nutcracker? Please, Herr Drosselmeyer? Of course. I would be glad to fix it for you, little Miss Stahlbaum. And... there. Right. Just like you. My goodness, little one, you seem to have really taken a liking to that nutcracker. Yes, very much. Actually, that nutcracker is quite an unfortunate little fellow. Huh? Would you like to hear his story? Oh, yes! Please tell me! <laughs> <laughs> well, now, the whole thing started when the greedy Madame Mouse Rings ate all the fat that was to be used to prepare the king's special sausage. You see, Sausage was the king's favorite food in all the world. On that very day, a sausage party was to be held at the castle. The queen was busy in the kitchen cooking fat for the king. Then, Madame Mouse Rings, who lived underneath the kitchen of the castle, paid a visit to the queen. Oh, please, won't you share some of that delicious fat with me, your majesty? The fat was a very important ingredient for making the king's sausage. The queen was troubled, but because she was so kind, she said... Here, then, I'll share some with you. But all of her noisy mice friends soon arrived, and they started eating it, too. By the time the servants had finally chased all the mice away, there was only a little bit of fat left over to make the king's sausage. And yet, somehow, sausages were prepared, and the King's Sausage Party began. Oh, they look so good. Hmm. Hmm? Not enough fat! Upon hearing from the queen that it was mouse rings who had ruined the sausage, the king was enraged. Then he set up mouse traps all throughout the castle to catch the mice. Madame Mouse Rings was the only mouse who did not get caught. This is intolerable. My friends, my sons, and even my aunt and uncle have all been captured. I must have revenge for this injustice! <laughs> 
you see, Madame Mouserings was actually a very nasty witch. <gasps> the king and queen had a very beautiful daughter. Her name was Princess Pilipot. Unfortunately, the princess soon became a target for Madame Mouserings. <coughs> Horror of horrors! Madame Mouserings had transformed dear Pilipot's face into one as ugly as that of a monster. The king put a bulletin out all across the land. Now hear this! Anyone who is able to undo the terrible curse wrought by Mouse Rings the Witch shall have my daughter's hand in marriage! Could it be that this person That's is... right! This young man is Christoph Zacharias Drosselmeyer. Drosselmeyer? So could he be someone who's related to you, maybe? <laughs> well, perhaps. Anyways, this particular young man had a magical walnut that could break the awful curse that Mouse Rings had put on the princess. It was many years ago, but I bought this from a mysterious walnut seller in a distant town. He said that it has strange powers. Here, take this. Maybe it will help you, princess. Oh, here, I'll crack it open for you. Here. Oh, that annoying newcomer. I'll never forgive anyone who interferes with me. Ah! Ah! Oh, goodness, poor Mr. Nutcracker. If it had been me, I would never have disliked you no matter what happened. The Princess Pearlypad is a bad person. I wish there was some way to turn Mr. Nutcracker back to the way that he was before. Here, it's a gift for you, little one. Oh, what a pretty necklace! If you keep this pendant with you, then your wish will surely come true. Huh, thank you, Herr Drosselmeyer! to us. The Mouse King? Yes, he's the last son of Mouse Rinks the Witch. He's a monster more evil than the devil. The son of Mouse Rinks? Now, every 
everyone! Let's bring our forces together and defeat the evil Mouse King! Surely come true. This pendant. Let me go! Let me go! Save Mr. Nutcracker! Sincerely kind feelings for me were able to undo Madame Mouse Rink's curse and change me back into my original form. Where are we? It's my homeland, the land of sweets. Really? Everything is so beautiful. <laughs> This flower is candy, too, isn't it? All the plants, the trees, the flowers, everything you see here is made of sweets. Uh, <laughs> oh, watch out! Oh, 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 please help me, Kristoff Drosselmeyer! Oh, Clara, come on! Clara! Come on, wake up, Clara! <laughs> You're still asleep. Father! Father! Claire's acting really weird. It's true! Mr. Nutcracker fought the Mouse King and then he took me to his kingdom in the land of sweets and... Oh. Where is Mr. Nutcracker gone? Mr. Drosselmeyer, it's just awful! My Mr. Nutcracker is... Ah, hello, little one. <gasps> oh, this is my younger brother's son. Hm? Hi there. His name is Christoph. Your name is Christoph Drosselmeyer? Mm -hmm. 